the first step taken by the federal military government to effectively set in motion the immediate of of the new state was the appointment of Colonel Abdullahi Sarki Mukhtar as the first military governor. I, Lieutenant Colonel Abdullahi as Mukhtar, do solemnly swear that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the federal republic of Nigeria, that as the governor of Katina State, I will discharge my duties to the best of my ability, faithfully and in accordance with the laws of the republic of Nigeria, and always in the interest of the sovereignty, integrity, solidarity, well-being and prosperity of the federal republic of Nigeria, that I will exercise authority vested in me as governor, so as not impede or prejudice the authority lawfully vested in the president, commander-in-chief of the armed forces of the federal republic of Nigeria, and so as not to endanger the continuance of the federal republic of Nigeria, that I will not allow my personal interest to influence my official conduct or my official decisions, that I will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the laws of the federal government of Nigeria, that in all circumstances, I will do right all men of people according to law, that I will not directly or indirectly communicate or reveal to any person any matter which shall be brought under my consideration or shall become known to me as governor of Kazan State, except as may be fair for the due discharge of my duties as a governor, and that I will devote myself to the service and well-being for the people of Nigeria. So help me God. Colonel Sarki Mukhtar's swearing in ceremony was presided over by President Ibrahim Babangida himself and was attended by members of the Armed Forces Ruling Council. It was a dream come for the people of the state. They gathered at the boundary between the new state and the old Kaduna state to welcome the new governor.